Previously, we were not really impressed by Dell's work in the gaming laptop market. And more often than not, the reason for that was the cooling solution. Today, we have the G155-15 Ryzen edition in our office. Its design is revamped once again, and we hope that this year, it will be for the better. Looking at this device we can't help but notice the similarities to Alienware's M15 series. Nevertheless, it is an entirely plastic product, with some speckles residing inside of the material. It weighs 2.81 kilograms, which is significantly heavier than the competition. The keyboard has decent key travel and an optional 4-zone RGB backlight. While the trackpad is fairly accurate and responsive, it is too small for our taste. The I.O. is scattered pretty much everywhere but you'll get, power plug, USB Type-C 3.2 Generation 2 port, 3 USB Type-A 3.2 Generation 1 ports, HDMI, LAN port, security lock slot and an audio jack. The memory and storage can be easily upgraded, so don't forget to check out our disassembly video. There are two SODOM slots for up to 64GB of dual-channel RAM, and two M.2 slots for PCIe X4 SSDs. You can choose between 120 or 165 Hz IPS screen with full HD resolution. We bought the 120 Hz one, and while both of them should have great viewing angles, this one has an excellent contrast ratio and mediocre maximum brightness. Also, it covers just 54% of the sRGB color gamut, and the color accuracy is acceptable only after installing our display profile. The screen isn't suitable for professional work so the colors aren't that important, more important is the lack of pulsations, the screen doesn't use PWM so it's comfortable for long gaming periods. Only 2 per 100 people watching this video are subscribers. If you decide to just start following us, we'll be able to reinvest more in our laboratory thus making even more helpful videos for you. Thank you, you're awesome. The battery in our Dell G155-15 has a capacity of 56 watt hours which is enough for more than 8 hours of web surfing or video playback. G1555-15 is available with AMD Ryzen 556-200H or Ryzen 758-200H processor, and three different GPUs, RTX 3050, 80 watts, RTX 3050Ti, 90 watts, or RTX 3060, 115 watts. There's also an Intel variant of these series and it's called Dell G1555-11. The 5511 can be ordered with up to Intel Core i7-11820H. Of course, we'll get a configuration with an Intel CPU too, so you can expect detailed benchmarks and comparisons on our website. Here, you can see that the cooling consists of two heat pipes common for the CPU and the GPU, and one more for each of them. Additionally, there are heat spreaders on top of the graphics memory and the VRM modules. Dell did surprise us with this one. They fixed arguably the biggest issue of their gaming notebooks, the cooling. The first column shows a computer's reaction to a short load, 2 to 10 seconds. The second column simulates a serious task, between 15 and 30 seconds. And the third column is a good indicator of how good the laptop is for long loads such as video rendering. In order to provide more breathing space for the graphics card, we see a very lenient approach for the CPU thermals. As you can see, the temperatures remain pretty low even after 15 minutes of stress testing. When it comes to the graphics, we see that the RTX 3050 Ti inside of this device completely obliterates the competition. However, it wasn't able to achieve its 90 watts TGP limit, as said inside of Nvidia's control panel. Indeed, the fans of this thing were pretty loud, but we've definitely heard louder models. Also, thanks to the additional space behind the screen, the heat is moved away from the keyboard, hence, the hottest spot we measured was barely exceeding 36 degrees Celsius. Ultimately, we feel that Dell has more job in hand for their next generation of gaming laptops, as this one was particularly heavy, especially for a 15-incher. On the other hand, the gaming capability of this particular unit was commendable, and we are happy to see the cooling improvements. At the end of the day, the affordable price of this laptop makes it a very good offer.